trucking. Are we going to do what they say can be done? So out with the old and then in with the new. So rotate your stock. And I just wanted to show you this. We used square buckets. They're four gallon square buckets. And they give, I already took the seal off the lid. So then you pop the lid off and take a look at this bag of rice. We're going to pull the rice out of the bucket and take a look at the way this rice looks. Okay, go ahead. Now that is a block of rice. Did you hear that? This is vacuum sealed. And I'm going to show you that in another video. What we did was we vacuum sealed it and it's, it becomes a super solid block of rice. If you notice, the sealing, I've got a five layer, five bar sealer so it seals really well. This good Mylar bag has not allowed any air in it. That's what you want for long term food storage. Now we're going to open it up and look at the quality of our rice. You seal it at the top and then you bunch the bag in. Then, if you're very careful with the bag, you can reuse the bag if there's no more available someday. Alright, now we're going to take a look and uh, open it up. Okay, go ahead. Just cut along the very top all the way across. Here we go, watch. Hear it? And then we look in there, there's our rice. Perfect. There you go guys, an actual long term st storage opened up for you. One other note I want to make is notice how clean the inside of that bucket is. When I packaged this stuff, I was very careful 